Hi everyone, I hope you've been well. This is Grace, and I actually was not planning on doing a video this weekend because it is the 4th of July, and um, I was using today to really catch up on a lot of backed up errands and um, organizing, cleaning, and there was one DIY that I'd been meaning to do for ages um, in which I refashion. Um, it's it's a coffee mix box that I usually buy. Just imagine it as a thicker cereal box that's bigger. But anyway, um, instead of throwing that in the recycling bin, I just collected three of them. I um, super glued them together. I am covering the what am I talking about? I'm covering the outside with some of that contact paper from Dollar Tree and um, anyway at the end of the video I'll go ahead and insert the picture there um, at the end just to kind of show you what that picture looks like but anyway so in the process of doing cleaning and getting some of these long um, there's Bentley hey Bentley um, projects um, off my you know to-do list I realized that someone keeps taking my broom so I have a broom in my bathroom and I have a broom and dustbin um, like a small one that literally is the size the brush is like really tiny and then the dustbin is about that size too you know just to kind of sweep up all the hair that falls and dust and what have you and this is the second time now that my br broom and dustbin have disappeared and so instead of harassing my family members demanding to know who took it I decided you know what let's just go to Daiso I was actually in the area Bentley wanted a little outing anyway Bentley 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 do you want to say hi <gasps> Bentley Bentley you want to say hi to everyone nope he's just intent on cleaning Anyway, so I finally um, bought one. This was $1.50. You guys know everything at Daiso is $1.50 and less marked. And then while I was there, of course, I couldn't resist checking out what washi tape. This I had seen before and I had resisted, but I decided this time I would get it. And this is just masking tape. So it's not really washi tape, which is the paper tape. And then this is masking tape again. And I love this new design. This is the first time I've seen it there. So um, it's really nice because it's 15 millimeters and then 10 meters each. So I love the fact that you get a lot of product. And then this is a little key um, holder or key cover. And this I ended up getting for a friend whose birthday is coming up. And then same here. I have two friends whose birthdays are coming up and both of them love cats. And so I thought that these would be really cute sticky memos. And what's really cool is for those of you, when you look at the back, it's not just a plain white. They actually have um, the backs of kitty cats printed as well. So I thought that was cute. And then whoops. And then what surprised me, I've never seen this before, are the sticky notes. And here's my hand so you can kind of see them in reference but I just thought that these were really great um, especially for those of you who are into planners and decorating your planners and take a look it's one of those things where if you can you bend it and it becomes this makeshift book that you can just carry around easily and I just thought it was such a great idea so I ended up getting one just to make sure uh oh do you see Bentley he smells food in the kitchen. Anyway, so I'm upstairs because um, my family has the TV turned on downstairs. Anyway, so there's that. And then these are some decora decoration tapes. Really tiny, cute. Um, it's only four meters long, but I just love the dispenser package and these little flowers and so. I don't know whether I'll end up using it, but I do plan on giving these to a friend. And then, this is always also going to a friend, and I thought that I would personalize it um, with her name here, just because she does some um, things for me that um, she doesn't have to, and it's always a voluntary thing, so a way to thank her. So, 
that is it. A small Daiso haul, but um, a really good number of items. I was really surprised. So, um, yeah, if you are in the market for one of these things, you may want to check out your Daiso and see what little goodies there are. But yeah, those of you who are into the whole planner thing, if I'm not careful, I think I may be joining you in the whole like crazy decorations. So I'm going to try to restrain and <laughs> anyway, Bella, you want to say hi? Alright. Anyway, alright. And um, at the end, as I promised, I will upload the picture, the finished product of um, the DIY, I guess, storage thing. So, um, what was really cool is Daiso, I don't know if you guys know, has this like Lazy Susan turntable for $1.50. And so, I know that um, those of you who are Dollar Tree um, people, uh, what was it? Alejandra TV had done that um, idea of getting two baking pans, putting marbles, and then using it as a turntable. But that ultimately costs, what, $3? And, you know, granted, you could reuse it for actual baking and things like that. Um, I thought that when I saw the turntable at Daiso for $1.50, that that would be a much economical, and it would just be better for me at least. So anyway, um, I will be inserting the picture in the um, end. I hope you enjoy, or maybe a little video clip. So all right, take care, everyone. Have a great 4th of July if you celebrate. And hopefully I can get this video up in time. All right, bye. All right, guys, so excuse the mess. I, as I said, I am cleaning, doing DIYs. Anyway, this is the box that I was telling you, the coffee mix box, and so um, I ended up drinking over time, or emptying, three of these, and so there we go. This is what it looks like all, and you guys, the print should be recognizable. This is the um, turntable from Daiso. So let me actually just push, th you can see that, and that's it. It's only $1.50. They had smaller ones in different colors too, but yeah. Um, there's that, and then what I did was I cut out do you remember that big huge display um, clip that I ended up getting or that display board from Dollar Tree so I just asked them if I could have it because they were just gonna throw it away and then what I did was I cut it out and then I bordered it with some of the tape and then this is ideally what it's gonna look like and then it's on a turntable so if I want I can just very quickly turn it around and I'm planning on keeping my stickers and all of those things here. Um, if I were to do this all over again, what I would probably do is put either foam board or cardboard between the two boxes just to give it much more stability because I won't be able to put really heavy stuff for fear that it's going to break. So anyway, that's it, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.